So today I want to talk about a really frustrating issue when your C drive is suddenly full for no reason. As you can see, my C drive is completely full. There's almost no space left at all. And at first I was really confused. I thought, what could possibly be taking up this much space? So I opened the storage settings to check what's going on and guess what? It shows that apps and features alone are taking almost 80 gigabytes of space. Now that's strange because I don't have many heavy apps installed on this PC. The only big software I use is Adobe Premiere Pro, which takes around four gigabytes. Other than that, most of my apps are just small utilities. All of them are just a few megabytes each. There's no way these apps are taking up 80 gigabytes. Something clearly doesn't add up. Well, here's the catch. Apps like Premiere Pro often create cache files in the background. These files don't show up in the apps list or storage breakdown, but they silently eat up a huge chunk of your SSD. So in this video, I'll show you how to find and delete those unnecessary cache files and instantly free up space on your SSD. And hey, if you're new here, consider subscribing to the channel and hitting that like button. I share simple tech tips like this to help you keep your PC running smooth. Let's get started. First, press Windows plus R on your keyboard to open the Run dialog. Now copy and paste this command exactly as it is. You'll also find this command in the video description. Once you hit enter, it will open a folder full of Adobe Media Cache files. In my case, there are over 86,000 files here. All of them are just temporary files created by Adobe Premiere Pro, and you don't need them anymore. Together, they were taking tens of gigabytes of space. Select all the files by pressing Ctrl plus A, then hold down Shift and press Delete to permanently delete them. This skips the recycle bin and clears your drive instantly. You may need to wait a few seconds if there are a lot of files. In my case, it's taking a bit longer because there are thousands of cache files piled up over time. Now most people don't even know this method exists. Usually when your drive is full, you might go uninstalling apps or trying disk cleanup tools, and sure, that helps a bit. But here's the thing, as those methods don't target hidden folders like this one, Adobe apps quietly store all these temporary files in the background, and they're not removed automatically even after you close the program or delete old projects. That's why this method is so effective. We're going straight to the source of the clutter and clearing out files that the system tools often ignore. And the best part? You're not deleting anything important, just old cache files that Premiere Pro can recreate if needed. So don't worry, this won't affect your actual projects or any Adobe settings. Once this is done, you'll see a noticeable difference in your available storage. All right, now let's go back and check the C drive. Boom, from completely full to over 20 gigabytes of free space just by removing hidden junk files. Bonus tip, this also works for other Adobe apps like After Effects or Audition, which store their own media cache too. So if your SSD is mysteriously full, always check for hidden cache folders, especially if you use creative software. That's it for today's video. If this helped you, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out and motivates me to make more tech tips like this. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.